tracking severe weather right down to the neighborhood where you live. WOWT 6 is the weather authority. Well, the first half of the weekend was beautiful. Now we push into the second half, and I think for the most part, you'll like the forecast. Perhaps gets a little bit windy for us on Sunday afternoon, but all in all, nice finish to the weekend. Start you off here at midnight. Notice temperatures fall back into the 50s. Waking up early Sunday morning at 6 o'clock, perhaps taking a morning run or getting ready to go to church or run some errands. Temperatures at this point, upper 40s to lower 50s. At 6 o'clock, there could be just a few isolated showers out there, maybe a few sprinkles. I don't think much will be out there, but best chance for that will be to the north of the metro. But I think by about 9, 10 o'clock, all that moisture moves off to the east. Temperatures rebound nicely. Eventually, we're into the middle 60s, it looks like, by the noon hour. Partly sunny skies, which you don't see here, as winds out of the east, 10 to 20 miles per hour. Could gust as high as 30 miles per hour tomorrow afternoon. So it's going to be windy for a Sunday, but at least temperatures still seasonable. Notice by 6 o'clock, temperatures hovering right near 70 degrees. That'll be your high temperature. Then temperatures start to cool off as we go into the evening. And I think by 9 o'clock, we're back to 60. So as we go Sunday night into Monday, expect cooler conditions waking up Monday morning. Will be somewhere right near 48 degrees. As far as your extended forecast, Monday 73 degrees, Tuesday 76. No, that's not a typo. Wednesday near 90 degrees, the hottest day of the week. Looks like we see better rain chances arrive late Wednesday night into Thursday with showers and storms.